Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about the Ultimate Fighter finale. Ryan Loader versus Robert Valentin. Ryan Loader, 6-1, and 4-1, and one, his last five fights. Looks pretty, he's looked pretty good in the Ultimate Fighter so far. 33 years old, 6 foot 2. Doesn't say the reach, of course. Robert Valentin is 10-3, 4-0, 0-0 in one in his last five fights. 29 years old, 6'2 with a 7-7 inch reach. Robert Valentin is a monster. The power this guy is able to generate, even though he's a submission guy, nine finishes out of his 10 wins, has been finished all three of his losses, or two of his losses are by finish. Um, one TKO, one submission. So, honestly, it was knee barred uh, two years ago, was finished by punches. Ibo Oslin, who's fighting in a little while, in a couple months, finished him in the third round. I just really liked what he's been able to do on the Ultimate Fighter. I think he's done some really, really good things. The problem I have with him, hasn't fought anybody great. Yeah, he got a finish over Zoran Dodd, who was 15 and 25. Just hasn't fought great guys. I worry about the wrestling ability of Ryan Loader because he puts, him, he puts himself in bad positions. He really, really sometimes keeps his head on the side of, Oh, he can get caught with a modified guillotine or a guillotine itself. We seen last night Jesus Aguilar put someone to sleep with the guillotine. The guy didn't react quick enough, got stuck in the guillotine, couldn't get himself out, went to sleep. So I really like Robert, Robert Valentine. I think his explosiveness and his power could be a problem for Loader as the fight goes on. But I also see a, a spot where Ryan Loader is able to just grapple and keep Valentine guessing as the fight goes. The problem I have is Valentin is a submission guy through and through. Yes, he fights long. He has good finishing ability. We've seen on the Ultimate Fighter. But Loader, as the fight goes on, puts himself in bad positions with that head position. I think Valentine winning probably with a modified guillotine. I like Robert Valentine as your next Ultimate Fighter winner. And as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you're picking. Peace.